Hey guys, welcome back. Thank you so much for joining me for today's episode of my God of War Ragnarok playthrough. I'm not gonna lie, the last part was pretty tough. Um, Brock dying or Odin killing Brock, that was really hard and I was very emotional. Had to hit pause and stop playing just because I knew that if I continued, I'd probably still be emotional and yeah, I just needed to take a second. I still can't believe he's dead. I really wish that wasn't the case. I did not see that coming. That really blindsided me and I'm really sad about it. I'm usually not in the mindset of revenge and vengeance and, you know, um, getting back at someone, but F Odin, he needs to die. End of story. I hope this injury will be okay. I know he's taking it very, very hard, rightfully so, but I don't know. I mean, maybe he can get the last jab in Odin, maybe. <laughs> I'm very, very intrigued to see what is going to happen next. They said go home and prepare for war. So I have a feeling this part is going to be insane. I'm kind of excited. I'm kind of dreading it. I'm just, I, I'm very, I'm dreading what could possibly happen. But I know I just need to get started. So let's get into it. When we get back, we're, we really are going to war. It has come to that. Yes. God. When we were back in Svartalfheim, looking for Tyr, this isn't what I wanted. This wasn't what I meant. Not if it meant losing Brock. We know, Atreus. We know. So, Tyr? You really took everything from Sindri. Don't take to heart what's said in grief, Atreus. No matter how spot on they feel. So, Tyr has been dead this entire time? I'm gonna do this really quick. I feel weird, like, exploring. I, I don't know. It's Freya, like... But I wouldn't mind staying here in Midgard for a little while. Aye. A few last adventures to take our minds off the state of... Well, everything. Just not in the headspace. To just like explore a ton. But I do want to go return. The um ingredients, I guess. Did not mean to do that. The eternal campfire. I wonder what happens. Finish the story. Gladly. It was said that Yari and Soma first shared a kiss in the fields of Jotunheim. Wait, what? How did they get there? Don't know. Point is, they went on countless expeditions, each location more beautiful than the last. But they found as they did, the destination became less important than simply traveling together. What about the unnameable thing? It was home. Yari and Somar had found it in each other. Yari and Somar. All right. Meal of Comfort, a delicious creation that warms the body and soul, permanently increases all stats by five. Okay. Here we go. I'm actually just curious. Um, Midgard, 11%. Yeah, I mean, there's a lot to do here. Let's look at every place. I haven't even touched Niflheim. Niflheim and Muspelheim are like side areas though, right? They're not like pertinent to the story. 
Asgard, 0%. Jotunheim is 0%. Svortalheim. Svortalfeim. Svortalfeim. <laughs> I can never say it. Alright, let's go home. Wait. Why does it say I'm going the wrong way? Was there a... There might have been a travel location up here. I'm stressed. Boy, I'm stressed. Are we even sure Freya will still be at the house? Don't see why not. Odin's back door in was also his way out. Without the blasted raven apparently hiding in the broom closet, the house should be secure. And she will not turn away allies in her vengeance. Aye. It's all our vengeance now. And no more fake Tyr to twist our minds around. Oh, what a mockery he made of Tyr's desire for peace. And mine. He really played us that entire time. Wow. He played the hell out of us. Are you with us? Hmm. Good. It's time. Time for what, dare I ask? Time to unite the realms against Odin once and for all. Tyr tried to unite the realms. The real Tyr. Everyone loved him. And even he failed. Then we better not fail. Or there will be no one left to try. This is Ragnarok. And Odin's already heard every blasted plan we have. Yes, we've lost the element of surprise. More than that, we have only one way to Asgard, and it's not subtle. Gil Owen. It means we enter from Tyr's temple, here. Asgard's wall is here. Odin's host of Einherjar will hold the space in between. Which means we need armies of our own. As many as will answer the call, numbers Odin won't see coming. And that's just to reach the wall. To breach the wall, we'll need to find Surtur. Radatoskar was able to procure this. Where are we going? Will go. I know just where to look. Mm. Splendid. Allies, then. Who do we think we can get? I'll venture to Helheim. Try to recruit the army of the dead. And I'll return to Alfheim to unite the elves. But just like that. Unite the elves after centuries of war. Well, hopefully. Really like me in Alfheim. And you? To Valheim? Yes. To find Sigrun and muster the free Valkyries. Midgard has no army. Nor Niflheim, nor Jotunheim. That leaves only Svartalfheim. I'll go to Svartalfheim. Sindri? Are you sure? I said I'll go. But poor Sindri. <sighs> so be it. Good luck to us all. Where are we going? Maybe Jotunheim? Because it said 0% on the map. Off to Muspelheim to find the last fire giant. What the hell is happening I right here? I envy everyone else's impossible mission. Muspelheim. Like, what is that? I don't think I can level anything up at this point. Appreciate it if I could take those dwarven yeah. keepsakes from you. You need it? I got it. Um, yeah, I mean, I, I'm almost positive. I'm feeling uh, Yeah, I haven't gotten anything else. Oh, this is unbelievable. Oh, back here again. Oh, God. 
you said you know where to look for Surtur. Yeah. I unlocked the secrets in the shrine when I was in Muspelheim with Thor. Thor? Don't worry. He didn't see me go in. That was not my worry. Mm -hmm. Now look. When we find Surtur, we'll have to convince him to combine with his wife, Sinmara. Combine? Yeah. When the two of them, uh, join, they'll create an enormous Asgard-destroying monster. Oh my. Oh, I hate when the door spawns over there. Well, I hope this goes as planned. I have some doubts regarding negotiations with Rosfelker and Helheim. My thinking is that she may be more amenable to speaking with a member of the uh, deceased. Mimir, you're needed. Oh, death is a skill now. I suppose these two can survive a bit without me. Brother. If you wouldn't mind. Very well. Many thanks. His voice sounded really we'll muffled at the beginning of that. Hey, I think I can see Surtur's forge in the distance. <clears throat> that was odd. Surtur's wife. Where is she? Nifelheim, I think. <laughs> If we head down towards that tower, we might be able to see the forge. Okay, so I guess I was wrong. There are not side areas in this game. We have to go to Niflheim after, probably. Heads up! Where's Atreus? It avoids every attack! I wonder if they saw their prophecy and decided to isolate themselves in their home realms to fight it. Understandable. Hopefully they'll understand why Ragnarok needs to happen now. Hey, that's the other half of the broken moose behind seed we found. We can take it to a mystic gateway. Maybe we'll find Sutter's combat trials. Uh, we don't have to do all that. <laughs> There. Out the oh. oh, shit. might be past this lava fall you know this when i was here before i saw something that looked like a forge anyway all right i'm a little rusty it's gonna take me a minute okay can't go through there We need to be ready for Surtur, in case he doesn't want to help us. Ready? Prophecy says he and Sinmara join, but who knows how they're going to feel about it now. You would try to force these primordial beings into submission? Well, I don't know. We can't win this war without them, right? <sighs> we 
gotta be close. I can hear the fort. <laughs> Okay, let's see. Alka. There's one. Uh How in the world do I get over there? Alka. Okay, wait. Wait a second. Okay, I, I wish. Okay. I've got one more to work with. Uh. Where will this reach to? Why can't I get up there? Okay. So that's the furthest I can reach. I think I might see what to do. Okay, so we have that. Should have done it like right here. Okay. How in the hell? Okay, there's three. Maybe? There we go. Did I do it? Oh my god. That difficult for what? Try hitting it when it glows! 
There we go. Where's the other one? Behind you! Watch out! I don't see the last one. Probably up there. Yep. Oh shit. Now. <laughs> now it's moving in slow motion. There we go. Nice job. Flame I'm Phantom. Really sweaty. Let us find Surtur. Okay. Oh, I got a heavy runic attack. I should probably upgrade this. Yeah. Oh shit. This one goes up to four damage. What does this one go up to? Four damage, but a lot of stun. I like that. Shield. Get some more damage out of the wolves. Wait, before I continue, I think I actually, um, I could press the right buttons. I think I could upgrade these as well. Yeah, okay. Sure can. Hmm. Kind of weak. I. It's three damage. Three damage, but this has frost, and the other one has stun. Ah, uh, I guess I'll keep that one. That's fine. Blades of chaos. I think I leveled these all the way. Yeah, spear. Yep. Okay. Wait. One more thing. <laughs> I'm all over the place. Okay. I think I like having 
the little bursts of wrath. Yeah, I think I like that. So I'm gonna go ahead and pour into that one. And then... Always damage. Let me just make sure I have everything unlocked. Oh, missing this. Flame Whiplash can be instantly charged with tr triangle is pressed. Okay. Um, momentum. Greatly increases the burn of skill. We'll just do stun. That's fine. The spear hasn't been leveled anymore, so we're kind of just chilling on those abilities and then yeah all right sounds That's good gotta be him we will ask hello soldier well either it isn't him or he's ignoring us come You're on a bird Oh, maybe that door has to get opened for us or something? Holy shit. Um. The hell are we supposed to do? Oh. <laughs> this obvious path. My bad. Hello. We seek a fire giant. Go away. What just happened? Oh, hey, okay. You're on fire, but you probably already know that. Dragger on the left. Focus! He is the guardian of this realm. It is his right to defend it. Watch out! Left side! Okay, one down. Oh my god. I was not paying attention to my health at all. Shit. He's got a lot to answer for. As you said, we need him. <sighs> yeah, I guess it's up there. Chaos Flame. Okay. I won't help you. Who are you? Who you seek, and what's left of him. 
Why won't you help us? I don't want to. Elaborate. We'll die. Right. Because you've got so much to live for. Not me. Her. So what's the point of all this? You keep separate from Sinmara just so you can sit here and wait to die? At least if you joined with her, you'd be together again. We are together. Got her heart. She's got mine. It's not much. But Holy. it's enough. But you're not even... Have you ever been in love? It's pretty good. And Odin will succeed. And all realms save Asgard will fall. Well, he must die. It's true. But I won't sacrifice her any more than... You would him. Sorry. Come. Wait. Those blades. May I see them? Shouldn't matter. <sighs> yeah, that could work. What could? Put those in here, and I'll become your monster. But I don't want her involved at all. But the prophecy says you two have to combine. Sure this will work? What have I got to live for? Not here. Follow me. <laughs> My face is the same as Atreus. This is what the hell? Where do we go? Sutur has agreed to help us if we do not involve Sinmara. He believes that his fire channel through the Blades of Chaos alone can provide the spark needed to bring forth the monster who will destroy Odin and Asgard. This man of Ash cares nothing for his life, only for who he loves. He bears her heart in his chest and is separated from his own. As he is separated from her, I believe I understand his condition. The spark of the world. Which is? The place where Niflheim and Muspelheim meet. Where the first realms came into existence. You won't be able to get through this. Oh. Whoa. Uh, Surtur? Still me. Better than walking. What in the what world? What awaits us at this spark of the world? Magic. Primordial stuff. With that and your blades and my heart, we'll be good. I'll get big. Smash stuff. You'll like it. But what'll happen when you change? Don't know won't be me anymore. But how will you, or, um, future new you, know when to attack Asgard? You got the horn, right? Yeah. Then we're good. 
Oh, I don't know about all this. Sorter, were you here at the beginning of everything? Yeah. What was it like? Loud. <sighs> so, here it is. The spark of the world. This is... <laughs> what? Beautiful. I'll meet you across. Holy shit. Yeah. Odin knows we have yellow one. He knows you have the mask. After killing Brock, he knows we would seek certain to start this war. But what other choice do we have? None. He knows that too. Oh my god. The spark of the world, that's what he called this? Holy shit. <laughs> oh my god. Oh well. Something's about to happen because they're giving me health everywhere, so <laughs> that's a good sign. This is it. What about Sinmara? Oh my god. Should we at least tell her? No. It had hurt her too much. More than not knowing what happened to you? Sometimes loving someone is about choosing the lesser pain. That doesn't make any sense. I promise you'll stay away from her. You have our word. Holy shit. This is insane. Sorter, is stabbing you with the blades gonna be enough to create this new you? Sinmar's heart is cold. So beautifully cold. Your dad's now got my fire in those blades. If enough of me and the sparks fire, Go into enough of her. It should work. Okay. Come here. Holy shit. Oh, now, for the really painful part. My fire, her heart. Combine them, you get Ragnarok. It's time. gonna take no no fucking way oh my god oh my god Kristen missed Oh. 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 Oh.
Get tornadoed, bitch. to go through every single one. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> Holy shit. Wow. Wrist and mist. To fight two Valkyries in tandem is to face both the sea and the sky as they crash down as one. Their coordination in battle was unmatched. It is a pity their fealty to Odin is by choice and not a corruption abated by their death. I would always prefer a Valkyrie fight on my side. Their aim was to take the mask back to Odin and perhaps Atreus with it. I hope news of their demise travels swiftly to Asgard. Holy shit. Did it work? Sorter, are you there? Gale flame. Oh, that's what we need for the spear. Okay. You're that? 
All we have to what? do is call him with Gallarhorn when we're ready. Let's head back to Moose Blind. We can take the Mystic Gateway back from there. I am Ragnarok. What? It worked. I can't believe it. We've got Ragnarok on our side. Sorter's plan just worked. I mean, the Valkyries were a small setback, but I bet we've got Odin worried now. He knows we're coming for him. Holy shit. Think about it. We're gonna show up to Asgard, and Ragnarok's gonna come in and wreck everything. Odin <laughs> won't stand a chance. We're gonna win. Yeah, in a perfect oh, world, right. but... Groa failed to predict what we would sacrifice in return. Maybe she could only see the base off. This is gonna work, right? It must. I don't know. <gasps> oh, God. Ragnarok's strength grows. Hey, check out that cliff. The earthquake must have shook this place up enough to make a ledge. Ah! More of Odin's forces. Trying to finish the job is about to be started. Yeah. Behind you, incoming. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. Ah! Ah! This way, Father. We can climb back towards the gate. I don't think the plan is going to go as smoothly as so Atreus thinks. You fought in a lot of wars, right? You've never had anything like Ragnarok on your side? I have. And the creature does not guarantee our victory. Right. This whole place is gonna fall apart if those keep happening. Grab this health. Father, 
mother. There we go. And her yard aren't gonna stop attacking anytime soon. We need to get back. On my damn way. <laughs> I'm just wondering when the hell Thor is gonna quiet. show up, because it's inevitable. I mean, you're always quiet, but this feels different. I had hoped my days of ceaseless battles were over. I had hoped to never see my son go to war. You got my frosted! I don't know if that's a word, but what the hell? Okay. Man, these guys just don't give up. Ragnarok is here. They know what that means for Asgard. Let's fight! He's lost anything! Why does that do nothing? Holy shit. Are we not trying to get there? <laughs> Father, I know we're doing the right thing. Ragnarok has to happen. The price we and others paid for this war is high. It will only get higher. It'll be worth it. I feel like it didn't have to happen or something. I don't know. I don't know. I'm stressed. Brothers, how did it go? And yes, my usefulness to a certain Vanya Nupti did run out. Ragnarok awaits our call. As do the armies of hell. Thanks mostly to me. It seems war is upon us at last. Where to now, brother? We've some time before we're expected at the temple. This could be our last chance, father. Travel is to Tears Temple. Is this the end of the game? What? Okay, wait. We're missing a lore here and something undiscovered, but it says I've only completed 17%. So I must unlock something else, but I don't know how to get there. Oh. Okay, well, it's obviously on the other side. Probably just the trials, I would assume. Oh my goodness. Svartalheim. I mean... Okay, so I've done as much as I want to do in Vanaheim. I've done as much as I'm going to do in Alfheim. <sighs> I mean, Midgard is really the only thing... Maybe we do a little exploring around Midgard before we go to Tears Temple. Because I'm assuming once we hit Tears Temple, wow. that's it. It might pull this us into Endgame. The beginning of the end. The end for Odin. And after that, a new beginning for the rest of us. Atreus. I know. 
I'm just looking forward to seeing all the realms finally standing up to him. Elves and dwarves and hell itself. You are so certain they will unite? They have to. After everything they've been through. They have to. Don't they? They don't have to, but we hope so. Anything in Midgard you want to do? Yeah, I mean... I guess we can go do this you know, Berserker Gravestone. Freya and the others are still making preparations for the attack. So there's time. That's part of Tyr's statue. There's a lore. Defend the peace. You know, this looks like something a giant would wear. Good eye. Tyr's bracers were crafted by the finest artisans in Jotunheim. Like Tyr, the Jotnar also believe the best offensive strategy is a good <laughs> defense. So... This is how they chose to honor him. The giants were not wrong. Why isn't it coming up? Um. Okay. The codex is a little iffy sometimes. Tear's left bracer, defend the peace, found etched into a bracer from the statue of Tear. How did Tear accomplish this? Did he not take up arms in order to do so? Gravestone. No doubt a berserker awaits. Wonder how many of these there are. Oh, I'm over leveled for this. Kind of a relief to have one that's not purple, red, whatever. That one's so cool. Really? I should have had that. That. Oh my god. I choked that. There we go. Should have had it the first try, but it's okay. What is its connection to these spirits? It's a symbol of their betrayal, their cruelty personified. The sooner we are done with it, the better. If I can make peace with my blades. I suppose you're right. If Skofnun rids the land of these bastards, I can stomach its presence a bit longer. Frakni, the zealous, one of the King Hrolf's berserkers. Frakni would never back down from a challenge. Mimir tells me he spits after saying this, but refuses to elaborate further. Okay. Um, guiding light. Guess we can go see what that is. Uh, 
never seen craftsmanship like this before. Can't imagine how old it is. Now, where have we seen an artifact like that before? Tears vault. <clears throat> Stolen treasures for the first for the first time. And feel free to mark this down as it's unlikely to happen again. I am at a loss. I've simply never seen anything like this. It's clearly carved from stone, but I don't recognize the craftsmanship. It's old. That much is clear, but I can't even begin to fathom from when, whence it came or why. Well, that's only partially true. Given the statuette's measurements, shall we say, I suspect this may be a fertility idol of some sort. <laughs> you might just be right. Okay. Look, the oarsmen. Ah, yes. The warriors who sailed their landscapes across the realm in search of new lands to conquer. Hopefully this is the way I think it should be. <laughs> Ooh. There we go. an awkward spot. Oh shit. Oh, are you kidding me? Hopefully one of the little creatures is in this. Ah, oh, damn it. <laughs> Bet there's some lore on that. figure out how to get down there. What? Oh.
there really not a way down? I guess we'd have to go this way. All the way back from where we came. Wait, I should be able to jump right there. Hey, look at this symbol. Why, that's the crest of Fjotorlund. It was the birthplace of my dear Seagram. I never knew. Seagram's curse. was once a mortal princess of this realm. She was a mortal princess. Think there's another way around? I think I saw a staircase on the other side. <gasps> With the damn hints. Sigrun told me her kingdom housed a great treasury filled with the spoils of her family's conquests. Perhaps this outpost holds some of that treasure. Did she say where? No, just that they kept it hidden. Hear it. Where? Here's the 
Use the other staircase. Other staircase. Oh, okay, so this circles around. Gotcha. Shed some light. Okay. <clears throat> oh, an artifact from the River Empire. Never been myself. I hear it's lovely. <clears throat> Never mentioned. In a cursed name. Woe to the great princess Sigrun. Her heart is broken and her mind may follow. She committed a sin for which there can be no redemption. She loved the wrong man. Handsome of face and congenial of smile. He was perfect except for his name. King Helgi. Sigrun's father, King Hogni, would never approve of such a marriage for one separate reason. This is the name of his old enemy. So strong was Hogni's. Hatred of Helgi that he would never allow that man into his home. But Sigrun loved him still, and so she endeavored to convince her father that love should be, could be, stronger than hatred. She was mistaken. What's that? Looks like a key. Hmm. Wonder what lock that key belongs key. to. No lock. It is broken. Not broken. It's just split in half. Perhaps we could find its partner. Shit. Oh, there we go. Finally, a damn apple. I feel like these things are so rare. In there. What did the rune say? Secret. She loved another. A king named Helgi. <laughs> Seems they were madly in love. But her parents wouldn't let them marry. It must have been hard for her not to marry who she wanted. I imagine so. Oh, shit. These things are tanky. <laughs> That's frost in my neck, stump. Damn it. Level four, and I'm barely doing any damage. Like, what? This one's level three. I'll probably do even less damage. There we 
There we go. All right, let's keep moving. Hey, I've seen this before. You have? Yeah, I uh, snuck out <laughs> Sindri. We crawled under that giant arm to get to the Helheim Tower. Iron Peace, not a golden war. Iron Peace? That's Tears right bracer. Iron Peace, not a golden war. Found etched into a bracer from the statue of Tear. Iron is far stronger than gold, yet at times peace feels as fragile as an egg. One cancel out the other? No. It means it is better to live modestly and abide by strict rules of conduct rather than letting greed be the cause of conflict. Mm. Well said, brother. I would bet this helmet has maybe if that's what it is it looks like a helmet is that the helmet from your statue over there I don't know is it win mines not wars Tia understood the greatest fight of them all was the battle for people's hearts and minds Oh my god, go to the damn codex. When mines not wars, found etched into the helmet of the Statue of Tear, a radical philosophy for a god of war. Okay. I think I'm missing, what, one more? You don't like riddles, eh? No. Oh, you just haven't heard any good ones. Here. I'm tall when I'm young, short when I'm old. What A candle. Yeah. Heard that one before? No. Oh. Well, did you like it? No. I just realized we didn't get to hear the ending of Brock's riddle. What the heck? Ah! Seed of purchase. It is with great pleasure that I, Ingo F Yoni, hereby transfer ownership of my most prized relic to one Alvis Stonefoot in exchange for one quarter equity of his fledgling forge, 79 pieces of hack silver, and one wheel of dry aged Gamelos. May it awaken for him a trove of untold adventures and fortune. No returns or refunds accepted. Relic. Do you suppose it's the one we read about? Something to counteract a sleeping curse? <gasps> Counteract a sleeping curse. Does that mean we can awaken those things in Alpha? No. Okay. I'm not sure if that's how you were supposed to do it, but that works. So, sounds like things went well enough in Muspelheim. I mean, probably. Surtur didn't want Samar involved. So instead of them combining to form the Ragnarok beast, we did a workaround that left her out of it. Well, hopefully he still shows up at Ragnarok to plunge his sword into the heart of Asgard. And where is that exactly? Only Surtur knows. Um, 
That looks an awful lot like a raider camp to me. Shall we take care of them, brother? Raider keep. Okay. Oops. Didn't see her. Give him what for. Another raider to the left. That's so much more damage. Suspect that's all of them. Father, were those the same raiders we rescued our wolves from when they were pups? Yes. These were coal raiders. Wolf eaters. I bet they have other camps around here. If so, I'd like to take care of them so they can't hurt any more animals. Perhaps. <gasps> all right, let's uh, finish up the favor I already have track. I see. I keep thinking about what you both said. After what happened to Brock. That there's some things we just can't control. I know you were trying to comfort me. But how do we tell ourselves our fate is ours to make? And then when the worst happens, we say there's nothing we could have done. Wait. Some people Be ready for combat. I did not mean to stop him talking. <laughs> Second to disappear. Patrol we encountered in Midgard. The wind carried it since so far I could smell it long before I saw it. Fighting these beasts in the dead of winter is one of the few ways to keep warm without a fire. I appreciate this. However, we may run out of trolls. We can only hope. Okay. That over there it looks like a spear wish for peace be ready for war well i think that's the last of it doubtful we'll find any more interesting bits tears spear wish for peace be ready for war found etched into the spear of the statue of tear i agree with the sentiment 
Everyone from all nine realms really loved Tyr, huh? Where I come from, gods of war are not revered in such a way. Not all gods of war are the same, brother. No, they are not. Wait a second. Where is it? Is it up there? Okay. Ready when you are. All the armies are probably gathered in their home realms. Waiting for when we blow Gallarhorn. Guess I was kind of hoping to see some of them here. When all the realm towers open at once, we'll see plenty, lad. Odin won't believe what's coming for him. No. Odin had lifetimes to prepare for this. Whatever grows deception, he heard the truth as tear. Do not underestimate him. Oh, shit. speech, brother. Very inspirational. I'm not ready. Hold on, I'm not ready. Hold the hell on. I'm not ready. We're going to go back. I'm looking for the rift. Ah, oh, it's not gonna let me? Shit. Wow, the Valkyries look different. Welcome back. Hildesfini informed me of your success. We've been planning accordingly. Well, what would Ragnarok be without Ragnarok? Who else agreed to join us? I see the Valkyries. Better than that. They are reborn, corporeal and uncorrupted, thanks to no small amount of Vanir magic. They're shield maidens now. Nice. And your brother? He came through. The elves called a truce to unite against Asgard. That gives us an advantage by air, and with Hell's army for a vanguard. What about Sindri? Will the dwarves fight? We haven't heard from him, but there's time yet. And I think we have what we need to clear a path for the Ragnarok beast. Well, when you say it like that, why worry at all? Sigrun! It's good to see you so... alive. Oh, yes. I wasn't myself when last we met. I'm glad you're safe. My queen, the Shield Maidens will be divided among the forces breaching from Alfheim, Helheim, and here in Midgard. We stand ready. Kratos, Atreus, Amir, please excuse me. Oh, good night then. Freya, have you determined our path out of Asgard? If the towers are the way in, we count on them being the way out. And if they are not? Then we all know what we signed up for. Our plan is only missing one thing, a leader. That honor is yours. You have a righteous claim and the respect of your troops. And you have faced this enemy before. I held his invading army to a stalemate. This is our invasion, a siege on his terrain. I want our most experienced wartime general in the field. I don't care about the honors. I don't care about the prophecies and champions. I just need us to win. Freya. I know what I'm asking. Just sleep on it. Here we are. Kratos, your tent is to the right, and Atreus, yours is to the left. Mine? A young warrior needs his own space, don't you think? I do. Wow. <laughs> Thanks. Sleep on what we spoke of. Let me know in the morning what you decide. Holy... Get some rest. <laughs> You get some rest. I'm not ready to sleep. Hildy. Come join us. Have a seat. I miss anything? <laughs> Thor did this? We both did. Mother's axe and Thor's hammer. Just like in Venahan.
Why can't I interact with it? What? No. No. It's not going to let me interact with anything else. I didn't... I thought I had to go in the temple. I didn't realize... Oh, shit. Okay. Okay. Fine. Is what it is. All right, you guys. I guess I'm going to stop this part here. I accidentally started the main quests and it won't let me interact with anything. I have no idea if this next episode is going to be the ending, but I feel like it just might... If this next part does end up being the ending, then I guess I'm happy with the amount of side stuff that I've done. And of course, I'm going to get the Platinum Trophy live on Twitch. But I mean, I wish I could have done a little bit more, but it seems like because I talked to Freya accidentally, I can't. Who knows? Maybe I'm wrong. And after I rest, it'll let me start interacting with things again. But I have a feeling I'm about to go into endgame. I hope you guys enjoyed this part and I will see you guys for the next one. Bye, guys.